Hi and welcome to a yet another video. This is the fourth in our Drive the Marucci series and I'm here with my daughter Melinda. Hello! <laughs> so uh, we're going to take you from Bly Bly uh, right down to the mouth of the river on the south side of the river and uh, we're going to have a look at a few things around the place so stay with us and uh, oh, yeah. Plenty to see. Plenty to see. If you haven't seen our first three videos, we started off up at the source of the Marucci River. We followed it down through the rock pools and swimming holes and waterfalls and all sorts of things. We've delved in around Yandina, looked at a bit of the history, and we've shown you the story of the two mountains. Now we're going to look further downstream and get towards the mouth of the river. So we've come to Petrie Creek. Now Petrie Creek uh, comes all the way from up on the ranges in behind the Sunshine Coast, flows down through the town of Nambour and ends up joining the Marucci River not far away from here. So as we cross Petrie Creek, we're going to be coming up on Urbacca's uh, fruit shed. We've got to stop in there for a little bit. And right over there, that's my favourite fruit shop in the world. Urbacca's. Urbacca's. It's an institution. Okay. Let's go in and have a look. Yeah. Urbacca's is a local farming family. Here yeah, they're growing strawberries. They have this fresh seafood shed and there's a coffee van as well. So we just stopped in at Urbacca's and they've got this little coffee van here and young Maddie here is going to make us a beautiful cup of coffee. Thanks Maddie. And I think this is the most important part of the whole day. Yeah, probably, yeah, I reckon. <laughs> We're just heading past the Ingenia Holiday Park. Big area in there. All the caravans, all the caravans. <laughs> <laughs> so we're starting to see a few houses now, uh, and units, and all sorts of things. This is a very uh, populated area from here on in towards uh, Maruchidor. We're just going to stop in here. There's a boat ramp here, and it's what they call the cod hole. So it's pretty much at the junction of uh, the Marucci River, Udlo Creek, and Petrie Creek, and forms this great big wide section of waterway. I wondered which bit was the cod hole because I knew it was around here somewhere. I didn't know where it was though. So yeah. that's pretty cool. This is the cod hole. <laughs> there you go. The next thing we see along the river is on the left here, of course, is the Marichi River Cruises. This is where the uh, little seafood cruises run from, and it's just to the west side of the Sunshine Motorway Bridge. So as we head east underneath the Sunshine Motorway, we'll actually come to the next little stop, which is a rather unique sort of thing on the Marucci River, and it's these little boat houses. So the little boat houses belong uh, to the, some of the units on the other side of the road. Next stop is Chambers Island. And right next to Swan Boat Hire is the little bridge over to Chambers Island. So we'll go over there and have a look around. It's a pretty little island.
It's like they had to make a pub only different. <laughs> Out in the sun, under shade. Yeah, so we've just walked all the way across Chambers Island. It's probably got to be what 50 meters <laughs> at the outside. Our whole team not a, walk, including the bridge. <laughs> yeah, it's not a huge island, but it's a pretty little spot. Great spot if you want to bring kids. Fishing. Yeah, heaps of fishing going on all over the place. Not that you'll actually catch much because it's like a murky river, but today, you know, we're living hope. Yeah. <laughs> mangrove area, Chambers Island. The whole island is just a little sandbar in the middle of the river where trees have started to grow many years ago. And uh, here at on a king tide, this the water will come right up over here. Oh, I got it. The bird gets something, did he? I think so. He's like testing the waters. He's like shaking it a lot. This little section is Picnic Point. That little inlet goes into a housing estate, uh, like a canal estate in there. trying to navigate our way <laughs> along the whatever paths there are and hopefully it does go somewhere it's just called discovery land that's all that's it just found a butte spider from melinda <laughs> the very tip of the island. It's the rowing club building there. That helicopter's still going. <laughs> <laughs> Got something interesting going on. Yeah. Maybe they're looking for you. So we'll head back over to the other side of the creek, the river. <laughs> we had to wait a moment because there were children. Yeah. Too many children. Yeah. One less. Yeah. This city is jumping into, into shallow water. Yeah. This is another island in the middle of the river. And we're getting close to the end now. Yeah. So down there where those high rise are is uh, Marichidor. Over at the Sunshine Plaza, which is 
a um, probably the biggest sun, the biggest um, shopping centre on the coast. I can't get my words out today. <laughs> Hello, puppy again. And here we have Cornmill Creek, I think. Mm. Yep, that goes into the um, the river. And if you want good op shops down this, keep going down this road. Once again, I am in the car, so we get the good parking spots pretty much exactly right outside where we need to be. So we're at the mouth of Cornmill Creek. And if we have a look around here, there's the mouth of, well, there's the actual mouth of the river down there. We can sort of see Pincushion Island there in the middle. That one? That's it. Yeah, that's Pincushion Island. There's the main river. But as we spin around here, we come into this Cornmill Creek. There's the township or the entertainment centre of Maroochydore that we just came through. I'm going to walk down that bridge and see if we can see something. We're just walking along the bank of this Cornmill Creek. You see they built right up to the edge of it there with all these buildings. But it is a creek. And this is the Sunshine Plaza Shopping Centre and it's actually built over the top of this creek. So Melinda's an expert on this shopping centre, tell us all about it. <laughs> oh there's everything here, well it's all the chain stuff but um, it's got pretty good places, there's a decent sushi place over there. This is where we used to come and run amok as teenagers. Ah. Yeah, we'd catch the bus up here and we'd come in and we'd muck, run a little bit of a muck and come home at the end of the movies and yeah. And tell your parents you've been doing good things. Yeah. <laughs> Some lunch, wasn't it? It was. Yeah. Looks like there's some rain coming over there. Yeah, it could be a bit too, yeah. yeah. It's been a bit rainy lately. Ah, so yeah. it. <laughs> so, that little lump of land just there is Pincushion Island. Now, it's not an island at the moment because it's actually joined on to the north side of the river, which will be in the next episode, by the way. Um, so, that little Pincushion Island, occasionally the river will burst through there. Occasionally it goes out this side, so it sort of switches around. So yes, it actually is an island, uh, but it's... It's just a part-time island. Yeah, part-time island. You can walk to it at the moment. But we're nearly to the end of our journey. That's the mouth of the river just there, and that's where we're heading next. At this point, we actually come across the uh, War Memorial in Maroochydore. Just thought we'd stop and pay our respects. Lest we forget. So from this point on the riverbank, it's pretty much all devoted to leisure. There's a huge parkland. We've got beautiful views. There's Mount Coolum in the background. And you probably see Mount Nindri there as well. Yep, there it is. So the town centre and a few high-rise riverbank buildings are all there. But uh, yeah, this whole section of the river, there's parkland all the way along this side of the river. And right down the end there, near the mouth of the river, is the Cotton Tree Caravan Park. We'll go past that shortly. 
great big playground here, isn't it? busy in summertime but it's got some nice big pools and plenty of stuff to do so it's a good one and here is cotton tree and this is a little like cafe strip and those, it's those big trees there yeah have been there forever forever as a kid I used to climb all the around those when we were on holidays I think I might have done that as a kid too probably <laughs> I don't know if we're going to get in trouble for running on these things, but... Let's see how we go. So these things were installed to protect the mouth of the river's sand, because um, it just kept losing all of its sand all the time. And I've been here for a long time now. And I'm taking photos of the sky, not of the actual place. There we go. There's Dad in the background. He doesn't really get to be on camera all that much. Because he's usually behind it. And there's the sea. Hello sea. Hello people in the sea. And right over there is Malulaba. And that is Point Cartwright, which is like right in the middle, right now, of where we're looking. So that is a lighthouse thingy, apartments, and uh a nice walk around there, so it's pretty cool to go to. And the Lula Bar is just off in the little bayish area. And now, what have we got over here? We've got so, Pink Cushion Island. Yeah, Pink Cushion Island. Yeah. There's to the left of it. There is Majimba Island. Timber Island. Yeah, or uh, Old Woman Island. They sometimes call it as well. There used to be somebody living on that island. They did too. Yeah. 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 There's still remains of the building there, but not yeah. a lot. Yeah, and then we've got, do -do 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 -do, that's the dog beach over there for the doggies. I don't think there's any doggies on there at the moment, but that's where the doggies go. And we've got Coolum popping its head out the top there. And then we've got Nindri right there. And that's basically where the whole journey started, all up there somewhere. That's exactly right. Uh, we can just to the left of Nindri is that other little knob there, and that's um, Mount Iwa. Mount Iwa. Yeah, which we looked at in the very first video. The very first scene was from Point Glorious, and it overlooked there. So that's Point Glorious, that last little lump of land there. Now let me zoom in a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> There we go. So that's Point Glorious up on that little angular rise there. It looks over Mount Iwa, which is way behind Mount Nindari there. And you'll actually, if you span around, you might just see Karoi Mountain there in the distance there. That's the jingle. And the dip of Mount Coolum over there. Yay! You can just see the tip. is the journey and that's the mouth and it's a bit choppy and it's a bit brown because we've had so much rain but ordinarily it's beautiful down here and it's perfect for coming and having a swim and a paddleboard and it's jet ski if you want to be really annoying to everybody you can jet ski and yeah it's just a fabulous place what a joy we have right on our doorstep here on the Sunshine Coast so we're going to close off this video here. We're at the mouth of the Maruchi River. And uh, yeah, it's been a fabulous journey all the way around. It has been. But we've still got one more to go. No way. Yeah. Holy shit. Because we're <laughs> going to be doing the whole north, uh, yeah, the north bank of the river there. Which, oh, that bit over there. Yeah, that bit over there, which is going to take into account some of the uh, the Maruchi wetlands. And we're going to actually walk out to Pinkwood Island there, which is... Uh, 
Yeah, that little bit behind us. So, um, bring the bug spray next time. Yeah. Remember to like and subscribe. And I very rarely get to spend the whole day with my dad, so it's been fabulous to get to actually spend <laughs> a bit of time with him. So it's thank you wonderful. for yeah. bringing me on this journey. I've had a great time. Yeah, it's been great having yeah. you too, Mindy. Yeah. And no bloopers, so woohoo! <laughs> <laughs> Maybe a couple. Yeah. I haven't fallen off anything, so that's lucky. Puppy, Nanny Rose is going to go and drive through Nolan's. <laughs> That's how you do Nolan. Doing it for the Nanas. Wow, wow.